The only way to up the ante in a TLC match is to make it a fatal four-way. And these competitors are ready to go. Well, we can all talk until we're blue in the face, but the only thing that matters is what happens inside the ropes. Let's do this. But here's the thing. You have to perform if you want to bask in that WWE glory. This is undoubtedly the chance of a lifetime for Kane. In a fatal four-way, there are lots of moving parts. What does he need to do to separate himself here? Obviously a talented competitor, Michael. But in a match like this, sometimes it comes down to luck. Not all the time, of course, but sometimes. Well, he's seven feet tall, but his mean streak is significantly longer. Yeah. Tossed out like a rag doll. He dropped like a stone king. How many cliches can you and I use? Dropped him like a bad habit. Careful what you wish for. It can get real ugly outside the ring. And these guys are real ugly. There is absolutely nothing like the pure energy that runs through a crowd when that glass breaks and Stone Cold Steve Austin makes his way to the ring. You just know someone's going to get their tail kicked. Challenger starting to falter. In four-way matches such as this, things could get very ugly for him very quickly. And Michael, this might very well be where one of these guys pulls away from the other. Oh, it's been a great match up to this point, and this could really go either way. Though being in this business more than 40 years, I can truly say there is nothing like when Stone Cold Steve Austin walks down that ramp, steps foot in the ring, and opens up a can of... Well, you know what? On an opponent. It's awesome. He's been knocked out of the ring again. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. Stone cold with a counter. And after all these years, the rattlesnake still manages to impress me. When this guy's on, Look out. The ring may not be big enough for what's about to unfold here. Are you kidding me? This entire arena may not be big enough. He's making a statement here with this attack. Good grief. Tremendous impact with that ladder. And another shot with the ladder. Here we go. Back inside the ring. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh, look at this. When you go at an opponent like this, it means you're out for blood. The WWE World Book goes right out the window. Trust me, it's going to get ugly. There's a point where all of your training goes right out the window and you rely on instinct. After getting beaten twice with a weapon, you can bet this is one of those times. Heads up, what a move! The toll from this match is really starting to show. The more punishment he takes, the slower and slower he is getting back to his feet. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Here comes Psycho Sid. It. That's got to be it. Psycho sitting now. That's a finishing move, people. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. Hitting up. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. How's that for an assault? Now you have to stay on top of your opponents so your weapons tactic doesn't backfire. We all know what they say about Karma. I don't know how much more damage he can take. We've got a climber. Here comes Stone Cold. He's so close. He can probably taste the victory right now. He's right there. He unhooks that thing and this is over. 
He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. He's making a statement here with this attack. Thrown out with authority. Man, he hit hard. Psycho City showing a lot of heart here, but look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. Oh, and did you hear the impact? Oh, man. Kane is just getting hammered in there. We may be looking at the beginning of the end here for the challenger. At this point, it's hard to say one of these guys is in better shape than the other. This entire match has been so evenly contested. Oh, man. At this point, he's just risking serious injury. I mean, take it from me. One match is just not worth your career. Few superstars are as dominant as... Oh my God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. So good to be back in Music City tonight. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He's got victory in his grasp, guys. Come on, pull! Pull hard! The challenger not in a great place. And you have to wonder how much the challenger can sustain at this point. You said it, and he does not want to let his opponent gain some steam here and start to get the upper hand. Yeah, but at some point, one of these guys is going to pull ahead. And that might just be what we're looking at here. Here we go. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. Wow, he's still down after that. Still a long way from the top. Back in from the floor. Back inside now. We've got a climber. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. Look out below! This guy's just getting worn out. Higher and higher! He, uh... All right, he's going to have to hurry and pull. Think of the risk and sacrifices these guys are taking to get that down. This is unreal. The ring may not be big enough for what's about to unfold here. Are you kidding me? This entire arena may not be big enough. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. Toss to the outside like yesterday's garbage. Man. He's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. Leaving the ring here may change the entire complexion of this match. Yeah, and if their face hits this floor, it'll change the complexion for sure. Steve Austin doing a great job of turning that around. The ring may not be big enough for what's about to unfold here. Are you kidding me? This entire arena may not be big enough. Psycho Sid doing a great job of turning that around. Back inside the ring now. Well, he was able to reverse it. Get out of that. Interesting move here. Taking the match to the outside. Executed perfectly. And check out the look of satisfaction in those eyes. Man, this is non-stop. You need that and more to survive against Kane. Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. When he gets going like this, there are few better. Back into the ring now. Oh, no! Talk about getting launched out of the ring. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for too long. Thrown out with the door. Man, he hit hard. Heading up. The top of that ladder looks awfully far away. Smart move! 
And now the ladder has become a battleground. Oh, no. Be careful up there. Psycho Sid looks like he's really struggling right now under the pressure. The champ seems to have his number here tonight. And by now, you would have expected one of these guys to take control of this match, but it really hasn't happened yet. Man, I can't believe these guys are even still competing. What a match. Nice reversal from Psycho Sid. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Heading up. He's literally touching victory right now. He's almost got it down. Got it! Big victory in the Fatal 4 That's a big win 